Ever wondered how district cooling works? It starts at a district cooling plant, where the water is chilled and pumped through the pipe distribution network at 4.4 degrees Celsius. The chilled water reaches the tower and enters the energy transfer station in the basement. The ETS uses the chilled water to cool the building's water through the plate heat exchanger. The chilled water flows between two of the plates where the warm water returning from the building flows between two adjacent plates. Electronic pumps pump the building's cool water through the building into the fan coil unit, where fans push the air against the cold FCU coil, thus cooling the air and pushing it into the room. The water leaving the FCU after it's dissipated its coolness returns to the PHE to be recalled. Each apartment has an individual cooling capacity which is measured in tonne of refrigeration. When the thermostat is turned on, the cooled air is released, resulting in a happy, cool customer.